welcome back to my channel. I'm really excited about this video because it's my Sephora VIB and Ulta 20% off sale haul. <laughs> Topped both of those sales. I also had a coupon for Ulta and I picked up some very exciting things for my friend because we are doing a swap. Uh, I'm doing a swap with Canoe here on YouTube. I will have her channel linked below. So I'm really excited for that. So stay tuned. That's going to be a Christmas swap. So we have some exciting things coming. But yeah, if you want to see what I picked up at Sephora for the VIP sale as well as the Ulta 20% off, then just keep watching. All right. So I guess I will start with the Sephora things because there's not that many. Um, I picked up this, which is actually my new favorite thing. I love this thing so much. This is a Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in the shade Opal. I have used it twice already. I'm wearing it today. I layered it with another one. For some reason, this makes me super tan, and I really, really love it. I didn't think I was going to because I thought it was going to be too light for me and not even show up, but these are ridiculously pigmented and they sheer out very nicely so you're able to layer them and that's why I really like this. You get a crap ton of product. I feel like it might be more than an ounce. Yep, 1.7 ounces. It does come with a pump as you can see so that is very helpful and this is a winner in my book. Something that's not a winner um, in my book is the Shiseido Radiant Lifting Foundation and only because this is the wrong shade. <laughs> I started blending it out and I was like, oh, I can't even make this work. So I like took it off right after that. But I do want to get my correct shade and try it again. So there's not much to say about that one. I also picked up the Kat Von D Translucent Powder. I've worn this ever since I got it. I am in love. It is very similar to the Lorimer. I think this one is like eight bucks cheaper. So that is a plus. Um, I really, really like this a lot. So this is the winner. I mean, it's the translucent powder. It does a good job setting. Not much else to say. I actually did make VIB Rouge. So I got the NARS blush in Goli. I don't know how to say that. But it's a really pretty blush. Um, it's super tiny, which is really cute. I have so many sample blushes, I noticed. I like to test out sample blushes, so... This color is so pretty. Look at that. So I've been really enjoying playing with this and I'm really happy that I got a free NARS blush so that's always good. Leading up to the VIB sale I also had my birthday so I picked up my birthday gift and I picked the Marc, the Marc Jacobs one instead of the fresh one. I only like some fresh products so I didn't even want to like go that route but I really wanted to try the Marc Jacobs eyeliner. You get the Marc Jacobs eyeliner and the Marc Jacobs lipstick which is really pretty. I have to... Did I really just drop that? I'm really excited to play with this lipstick. I've worn the eyeliner twice and I really really like it. So. Yay for little sample sizes. So now moving on to Ulta. Start with my friend's, my friend Canoe's gifts first. She already knows what she's getting, so no worries there. Um, I got her the Makeup Forever eyeshadow. It's a red shade. I don't think she has a matte red shade. We talk all the time and about makeup specifically, so we kind of know each other's likes and dislikes. So I think she'll really like this, and I know she loves the Makeup Forever shades. And she also likes single sh um, single eyeshadows because she has a lot of Z palettes and she just got one that she needs to fill up. So I think she will greatly appreciate that. <laughs> Let me know if you do, girl, okay? <laughs> so I also got her the Ulta Beauty Beauty Blender Set. What is this called? The Complexion Perfection Blending Sponges and Setting Spray. I also got myself one of these. It's empty because I've been using it and I love it. I have not tried the matte setting spray yet, but I heard it's like okay. This was a recommendation from Emily Noel 83 here on YouTube, so I had to grab it. And it's very similar to the Beauty Blender, so that's exciting. Um, so I hope she likes this. Plus, look at how gorgeous the packaging is. Ah, I just love it. So again, I did end up getting the same one for me, and as you can see, I have that one. And the little one is actually really nice for doing your concealer under your eye. It really does a nice job. Okay, so moving on to Ulta. 
I got the blush. Oh, this is from Sephora too. This is from Sephora too, but it's not from the VIB sale, I want to say. I can't remember when I got this. But anyway, um, this is the Blushed Bronze and Ready to Glow Palette by Sephora. It's the one that has like all the geometric shapes. Um, Canoe, this is for Canoe, and she really likes the geometric pattern sort of situation. So I remembered that and I made sure to pick it up for her. So I think she will enjoy this. Plus, blush palettes are just so much fun. I got her the Tarte Gel Eyeliners because she had mentioned that she really wanted to try this and she likes gel liners, so I got her this. Um, it's really pretty packaging too, so I hope she enjoys that stuff. Um, now moving on to more random stuff. This is also from Ulta. I got a NYX glitter. I wanted to try it out. I tried to get the NYX glitter glue, but it was sold out, so I was kind of upset about that. So I still have to go run and get a glitter glue. I'll probably do that after this. And all the Wet n Wild, uh, what is it called? The Sparkle Collection, the Sequin Collection came out. And it took forever to get into my town, but I finally got it. So I went and picked up a rose gold pigment, since apparently I'm really into pigments and glitters. Um, this will be fun to play with once I get a glitter glue. And then I also ended up picking the Wet n Wild Highlighting Gold Bar. This is so pretty. If you end up finding it, please get it because you will be missing out. I love layering this with the Benefit What's Up highlight. I think those two go hand in hand with each other. And... It's, I just, I love this. It leaves me speechless because it's like $4 or less. Whew, mind blowing. That is everything, unless I forgot something. Follow me on Instagram if, <laughs> if you haven't been following me on Instagram, um, you should be because I will post you, post there if I forgot anything in my haul. So that is it for me. Thank you so much for watching and for hanging out with me and for sticking with me. I really appreciate that. Um, if you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and I guess I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, everyone!